One of the things that we don't talk about enough in the media is the mental well-being of startup founders. Startup founders are humans just like the rest of us, although they may not seem it sometimes. Um, they, or they do have just as many problems as the rest of us, and they suffer just as much, if not more, with their mental well-being as a result of the pressure that they're put under. And unfortunately, it ain't a sexy topic, so it's not something that the media talks about. Now, we've got a few videos coming out dealing with this topic, trying to have a good conversation around it and trying to give you some tips and advice and, and ways to deal with this. But I thought today I would just give you a quick snippet or a quick bit of hopefully helpful information um, which, will, which will help you. Um, before we go into that, uh, please like, share, subscribe and um, you know, follow us so that you'll be notif notified every time a new video comes out. Um, you know, we really appreciate it. We're just starting out this channel, so every single subscriber makes a big difference to us. So, without further ado, let's have a quick chat about this. Okay, so the last year has been pretty crappy for everyone. Um, the dreaded C word, which I shall not say, has devastated uh, people's lives um, directly and indirectly. Um, a lot of people have been ill, a lot of people have been ill with other stuff, haven't been treated, and a ton of startups have gone under um, because of the cash flow problems, because of the lockdowns, because of so many issues. Now, um, there's no... Uh, there's no uh, one thing that will fix this. It's something that we're all going to have to endure. But uh, one of the things I like to tell founders when we work with founders is, um, look, you know, <laughs> excuse the Batman reference. The night is dark is just before the dawn. So, um, you know, it might seem grim right now, but we're hopefully nearly at the end. We hope, for, hope so. No more Delta. Um, so... The tip is this, um, fundamentally, I always say, approach things with a PMA. What do I mean by PMA? I mean positive mental attitude. So, um, you have two approaches when you're faced with challenges as a startup founder. Number one is to get depressed and to get down and get stressed, and we've all been there, it's horrible. And that just leads to more stress, that leads to more loathing, that leads to more self-doubt, and blah, you find yourself going down the tunnel, which really sucks. Or number two, approach it as a positive thing. So I'm not saying embrace that problem and go, yay, I've got a problem. Rather, what I mean is, when you're tackled with that kind of, when you're faced with that kind of issue, then what you need to do is just say, right, okay, I'm going to have a positive mental attitude. Let's try and work through this problem and let's try and look at solutions and try and see positives even when there aren't any positives. Um, look, we've all had this happen. I've had a particularly crap last year, but hey, look, as a result of that, some good has come out and that is what I think we need to do. We need to view positives even from negatives because that will help make us happier and that will help our mental well-being. So the next time that you're faced with a challenge, take a step back, breathe, try to not stress, breathe and think, hmm, okay, right, let's be constructive. How can we deal with this challenge? And then try and view it in a positive manner and try and see positives even where there might not be any. And don't let it get you down. Now, I know I might sound like I'm saying, go hug a tree. Um, that also works. Uh, <laughs> but um, fundamentally, it's a very quick fix. It's a psychological approach, trying to be positive. Because if you surround yourself with positive energy, then hopefully positive things will happen. So... Uh, that's my short video tip for today. Um, we're going to be doing a lot more videos on mental well-being, talking about some of the tough issues that people don't want to talk about, but we need to have that conversation. Um, and we've got a ton of other great content coming out. So as I mentioned earlier, hit the subscribe button to be notified when we release new content and have a great day. Cheers.